everyone, it's Eden and today I'm going to be telling you about my plans for this channel and my new video ideas. So as you may have already guessed, Lala Loopsy Popular is going to be coming to an end very shortly. As soon as I make episode 17 then the series will unfortunately be finished. And I just wanted to take a minute to say thank you to everyone who's been so supportive and left so many nice comments on all my videos. Um, yeah, I couldn't have done it without you guys. That was really part of the motivation for making the series and carrying it on. And I have really enjoyed making it. It's been so fun. So thank you to everyone who supported me through that. Um, but I'm very excited to be starting, I guess, a new chapter. Um, because this series has been running for four and a half years now. And, you know, I think it's, I think it's probably time to move on anyway. Because that idea... Um, it, it's outdated um, and I have lots of new things that I've been wanting to show you to make um, so yeah I guess it's just the end of one story and the start of another one but without getting too sentimental and mushy um, I just wanted to tell you what my plans are next some of you might know me from Lullaboopsy Amino which is a platform uh, similar to wiki similar to Instagram in a way uh, where you can just post things about Lola Loopsies and there are loads of chat rooms and just people to talk to about Lola Loopsies. It's great, I've made like loads of friends on there so that's been really great. And one thing that I've sort of discovered from being in that community is that I do want to make more Lola Loopsie videos. So my channel is obviously Lola Loopsie LPS and my two main dolls I guess are Lala Loopsy and LPS but recently the only Lala Loopsy videos I've been making are Lala Loopsy Popular and while that's all very well and good when that's over if I just carried on the way I was I would have no Lala Loopsy content on my channel and I'd probably have to rename myself so I want to make a kind of conscious effort to make more Lala Loopsy videos because I feel as if I owe it to them they are my you know without a doubt they're my favorite doll I've loved them for you know, almost nine years, and I love the dolls, so I just really want to make more Lala Loopsy stuff. Um, and also because I've got a lot of comments on Lala Loopsy Popular saying, "Oh, finally, someone active in the Lala Loopsy community," and I don't want to, I don't want to let them down. I want to keep that up. Uh, it's not just about the fans; it's because I genuinely love these dolls, and I have a lot of ideas um, that could work with Lala Loopsy. So it's it's not just about oh fan service; it's about I, me genuinely wanting to make more Lala Loopsy videos as well. So that's one change that's going to be coming. Um, another one is I'm not really sure what to do about LPS Logic because as you guys may know if you've watched the series it's very dark and sad and while you know it's angst is all well and good it, it gets you kind of big cinema points it just makes me depressed to be straight up it's it's a depressing series it's about a murder right and it's not getting a lot of support it's not getting a lot of views comments and um, well that's not the only reason I, I'm on YouTube I'm on YouTube because I, I love making videos and stories um, it is quite disheartening to see something you put so much effort into just get such a bad reception so I'm really not sure whether I'm gonna be carrying that on or not um, and I'm sorry about that because I know I quit a lot of my series um, it's just it's just seeing something you've worked so hard on fail so badly is, is not very nice. Um, and in all honesty, I'm not sure where the plot's going. So initially, I, I had an idea of who the murderer would be, of what the motivation for that would be, but now I've grown up and I'm actually at the same age as these characters now. I've realised that, that without spoiling too much in case I carry it on, um, the motivation for the murder is just really unrealistic because, in a nutshell, Teens take drugs. If you're following me on Instagram, my username is LPS, exactly the same as my YouTube username. You might have noticed that I did a poll a while back about which series I should make next. So recently I've been having three sort of main ideas for a series and they are a My Little Pony high school drama series set in the US, a Littlest Pet Shop high school drama series set in the UK, and a Littlest Pet Shop comedy series set in the UK. So, it's up to you really. I'm gonna be making a pilot episode of the two most successful ideas out of those two, which were the comedy series and the My Little Pony drama series. And whichever pilot is more successful, gets more comments, views, likes, uh, I will be continuing with. But I also have another idea, one which I'm really excited about and 
I've been wanting to do for quite a while. And this idea is a series called Flashback Friday, where I take a look at ideas that I made in the past. So this is inspired by Jerry Berry, you know, the absolute queen, the legend. Um, she made a video a couple of years ago called The Bloody Saw, which was her reading off a script that she wrote when she was a lot younger and I guess acting it out with LPS and just sort of reacting to how she wrote when she was younger. And now more recently she's done a video of her first draft for Red Lights, her um, Little's Pet Shop series, which is amazing. If you haven't watched it, go check it out because it's an amazing series. It's probably my, my favorite Little's Pet Shop series to exist ever. Yeah, I've been wanting to do this idea before I watched her videos, but after watching them and just seeing how, you know, how funny they were and sort of the reaction it got, that made me really, you know, determined to make it. So. I've got so many ideas that I never made into videos or never kind of fully realised um, that I just think it'd be interesting to share with you guys and see how you react to them. So this Flashback Friday series would take place on a Friday um, and I make these videos showing you guys how I came up with these ideas, um, who I came up with them with, because a lot of these ideas were inspired by things I did with my friends or my cousin. I'll be showing you guys the inspiration for them, and then I'll also be showing you guys like the script or the plan I had, reacting to that, and possibly like acting it out with Lala Loopsies or LPS, whichever one I think fits the series better. Again, if, you, if you're not following me on Lala Loopsie Amino, go check out Lala Loopsie Amino, because that's where I post a lot of these things. Um, but I've posted, basically, the ideas that I'm going to be showing you so far, little synopsis of them. So we have Secret Spy School, which I wrote when I was eight, um, and it's great. There's also Snow Baby, which I made with my cousin. Again, we were about eight, um, and I made it into a YouTube series, but I deleted it and I just stopped making it because, um, well, not to blame him or anything, but he kept forgetting to bring his toys around, so we couldn't make it. Finally, there's a series called Neon Skies. It's not a series as such, it's a, it's a book, it's a story that I wrote with my friend based on real life experiences and a book that we read and loved, um, and it's about being in a band. And it also served as the inspiration for my YouTube series Face the Music, if you guys have watched that. Um, it's not great, I'll give you that. It's not a great series, um, and I cancelled it. So those are the ideas that I'm going to be showing you, and there'll be, there'll be plenty more because I was a very imaginative child. I was always coming up with ideas, writing them down, stories, books, films, whatever. Hopefully you guys will enjoy that. Um, I'm really excited about making it because I'm a very nostalgic person. I love just looking back in the past and looking at what I made. Those are my ideas for videos in the future, and I hope you guys will enjoy them just as much as I'll enjoy making them. Thank you guys for watching. Sorry for ranting at you for rambling for this amount of time. I'm hoping you haven't got sick of my voice by now. Uh, but I will see you in these videos coming very soon.